Hi, I'm Hayley. I'm a student at Staffordshire University and these are my reasons for why Socon Trent should win City of Culture 2021. My first reason is that Stoke has such amazing heritage. It was world renowned for its pottery and still is for its legacy. And it would be such a shame if history was lost. And I feel as though winning a title like City of Culture and the investment that could go into the city after that um, would just, it would preserve the heritage, but it would also highlight the heritage and Stoke-on-Trent would be put on the map once again like it was back when its industry was thriving and it would just be a perfect way to preserve the heritage and celebrate it and honestly if you can't do that in a city like Stoke-on-Trent where can you? My second reason is that past investment has already proven just what potential Stoke-on-Trent has. The expansion in the Into Pottery shopping centre um, where the Cine World and huge food court were built are just a taste of what can be done if a city like Stoke-on-Trent is just given investment and recognition that it needs it. It just proves that it's worth doing. You know, Stoke-on-Trent is not a lost cause in any way whatsoever. It has room only to improve and if it won something like City of Culture, that is exactly what would happen. My third reason is that, and although I might be quite biased in saying this, the university in Stoke-on-Trent achieves so much, so why shouldn't its city be recognised too? And Stoke-on-Trent plays a huge role, and I know from my own experiences in the life of students, in how they are able to complete their degrees, and it should be recognised for doing so. The fourth reason that I have is that Stoke-on-Trent itself has such a varied landscape. In Hanley, for example, you could turn around one day and you can find all the shops, as you'd expect, but then you go around the corner and there's Hanley Park, which is an incredible green space that has a canal going through it. And as somebody who likes the countryside, which I do, um, I find it lovely to have like kind of an oasis within a city, which isn't something that's so easy to find sometimes. And it really helps when you're talking about a city that has a university, because students come from all over. And to have such a varied city to live in, it makes it so much more appealing. And with something like City of Culture, I think even more students will flock to it and people who want to live there. Because actually the whole of Stoke-on-Trent is an incredible place and there are so many hidden gems and I just think that when people generalise they're missing out more than anything, they're missing out, they're encouraging other people to miss out and I think if, if we want to tackle something like that, winning a title like City of Culture is the way forward because it'll just prove to people that they've been wrong this whole time and I think people will change their minds about Stoke-on-Trent very quickly. So thank you for watching this and I hope I have inspired you to get behind the bid and support Stoke-on-Trent to become the City of Culture 2021.